if you are new to the channel and want to see more videos like this, then please hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Thank you and enjoy the video. Hello folks and welcome back to the channel. My name is Matt and this is Coins and More UK. Now before I start this video, I just want to say a massive big thank you to each and every one of you for helping me reach nearly 1,200 subscribers. Um, hopefully sometime over the next week or two I am going to be releasing a video which will be a giveaway, um, a thousand subscriber giveaway, just to say a massive big thank you to all you guys for helping me reach my massive first milestone. So let's crack on with this video guys and it is going to be a little bit different today. I've got some bulk packs here from my collection and I'm going to try and tell you a little bit of a story behind each one. So the first one um, that, I've, that I ever got was this Snowman 50p coin. Now I was collecting random coins before this but this was the first um, sealed bulk pack from the Royal Mint that I got and this was um, bought for me by my wife Amy and it was a total surprise, she knew how much I wanted this coin and uh, as you can tell I had this coin before I uh, realised just how much the hang bags meant to the coin value because silly old me, I cut the top off it instead of just undoing it from the bottom so unfortunately yeah I'm left with a uh, snowman 50 people that a hang bag and uh, I've been trying to track just the hang bags down but I've had no such luck so far but yeah the Royal Mint 2018 snowman this was the first ever bulk uh, uncirculated 50 pence coin yeah that I ever got in my collection okay now the next one the Gruffalo 50 pence piece now this has got a rather amusing story behind it because before I got obviously um, used to how the Royal Mint works, um, I stayed up for quite a while um, in, in the queue to order this coin. Now it was such a popular coin when it first came out that the queuing was just, yeah, it went on for hours. And I didn't realise obviously most people were queuing up for the gold and silver. And I didn't realise um, just these normal and circulated ones would be unlimited. So there's me stopping up till about 1-2 o'clock in the morning just to order uh, uncirculated Gruffalo 50 pence piece which was unlimited anyway and uh, yeah another uh, rather amusing story behind this one and again um, I cut the top off this one like an absolute numpty and I'm without a ham hang bag again for this Gruffalo 50 pence piece but I'll never get rid of these coins so um, it's not bothering me too much but as my collection grows I'm getting a bit OCD and I really want to try and find some hang bags so uh, yeah, if you know anywhere where I can just get the hang bags, let me know in the comments below. Okay, next up we have got the 2019 uh, Beatrix Potter Peter Rabbit. Um, again, I just love love the Beatrix Potter coins. It was actually um, getting these coins in my change, which started off my whole collection in the first place. So I've been quite faithful to this collection. And I thought, yeah, um, this isn't going to be circulated, so I just had to get my hands on a bulk pack Peter Rabbit, which is um, a 2019 coin. Uh, there is a video um, put out on all these coins if you want to head over and check them out. But as for now, yeah, I had to get this coin. It's, it's a rather nice design. I think the Beatrix Potter coins are getting a little bit tired now. And yeah, it would be nice to see some uh, different um, sets or series on the 50p coins or £2 coins as well. Okay, next coin up is the Stephen Hawking 50 pence piece. Again, this is one that I really, really wanted. And as soon as it came out, I ordered it straight away and it was pretty much here within the first week. An absolutely, an absolutely stunning design. I just had to get my hands on it. And again, it is. Um, I think this was the third bunk pack that I ever bought. And I just absolutely fell in love with it. It's uh, such a nice design, and obviously, it's um, a commemorative coin for Stephen Hawking, who, uh, yeah, sadly passed away. But yeah, this one went down really well with coin collectors. I do apologise about the lighting and the zoom. And it was a very popular coin, but luckily I managed to order this one straight away and I was, I was more than happy with it. I'm so happy that I got this one. Okay, and uh, another bulk pack in my collection is the Sherlock Holmes. Again, such a stunning design. I'm so happy this one came out into circulation. This is a 2019 commemorative coin. 
and if, yeah, if you keep an eye in the change guys you'll be seeing this coin quite a lot whether it will be high minted or not um, only time will tell but it, it is po possibly one of my most favourite 50p coins um, to be released since the Isaac Newton and yeah I ordered this um, as soon as it came out and I had this within the week and yeah I just absolutely love this coin I think out of all my bunk pack coins this is certainly my favourite and uh, last but not least now this is one which I got for my birthday um, my birthday is in a couple of days time but um, I, I got this one early uh, my wife bought me this I, I've been nagging her for ages about this and um, for some reason I've just never got around to ordering this set I, I just don't know why um, of course a very popular set again because you've got the uh, the Kew Gardens design just there and again you've got some other 50 pence pieces as well like the Britannia the uh, Roger Bannister and it was a five coin set which was released in 2019 I missed out on the silver proof set which I did try and get but um, I missed out so when they announced that they was releasing just a, a normal uncirculated set I was absolutely over the moon I have ordered the other 50p set which is the military ones and I can't wait to get that either and as soon as I get it there'll be a video and a little review on that pack uploaded ASAP and, and that's it guys these are just like some of the book packs in my collection I'm forever adding to all these and yeah if you want to get hold of any of these you can find them on the Royal Mint for £10 each or if you head over to um, other certain coin channels you can pick these up quite cheap but if you head over to UK Coin Hunt, you can pick this coin up for under £8. I'll leave a link in the description below. But yeah, that chap is selling these for under £8 each, these Sherlock Holmes. I think he has only got a limited number left, so he's probably sold out by the time this video goes out. The Royal Men um, UK Coin Hunt's website, please go and check all them channels out if you want to get your hands on any of these commemorative coins. And yeah, they're just fantastic additions. To anyone's collection and yeah I'm sure this pile will be doubled in size by the time I do another video on these all that's left for me to say is thank you very much for watching uh, thank you for all the support on my channel just recently and as always just stay absolutely awesome uh, have a fantastic week and I shall see you all in the next video for more coins bye